Fortunately, I didn't pick up that Scouse accent. <laughs> <laughs> English food. Bottom, yeah, by far. He's had enough. I said, yo, I tried that fish and chips, yeah. <laughs> it was the same, watch. I'd say date night. <laughs> Is that because you're paying, yeah? <laughs> it's on you, yeah. Man said the. You yeah, get yeah, me? Yeah. <laughs> it's always in school, man. It's school. All right, then. What's good, guys? Next gen. It's group chat on tour. We're in Rouse Soul, see dad. I'm with James and Jules, yeah? We've got a special one for you today. I'm with my boy Mo. I want you to introduce yourself, mate. Let's tell us about yourself, tell us about your club, tell us about your position. Yeah, so my name is Mohamed Ali Cho. I'm 19 and I play for Rouse Soul, dad, and I play as a forward as well. Yeah, man. So, um, how would your friends describe you? You know what? Everyone says like, I'm pretty chilled, pretty funny. Yeah. I don't like headaches. So, yeah. you know, chilled and funny, I'd say. Yeah, you, you got you got yo, you got the London twang on box, bro. Let's you get, get into that, man. You get me like, uh, we're in Spain. <laughs> you get me like, you get me. I'm, I mean, I'm mean, hearing you speak French, but you got the London accent on box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's exactly. that come from? So when I, I was born in France and I moved straight away to London, I lived in Elephant and Castle with my family. Okay, okay. So I grew up there. Yeah. And I learned French because I moved back to France yeah, after yeah, that. Yeah. And then yeah, I went back to England, played for Everton. Yeah. But fortunately, I didn't pick up that Scouse accent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fortunately, so we don't want that Scouse accent, you know? Nah, man, never want nah, that There's <laughs> another thing to include. Once again, South London always produce ballers. Whether they stay in South London or not, they, they got their way of just, just getting someone and saying, yeah, yeah. It's, in the, it's in the water. Yeah. <laughs> so you're a young lad, but you're seasoned, been around the block and that like, had your experience. And yeah. you get me sick, man, we love that, man. So um, tell us how you got here and where you hope to be in the future. Yeah, so I signed my first professional contract in France mm -hmm. in a club called Angers. Okay like mid-table in first division of France. Yeah, so yeah, like, yeah. I got my, my first minutes there. I played two years in first team over there. And then last summer I got brought from here to play here. So yeah. So how many languages have you got under your belt? I'm going to say three. Three, what them? French, English, and I'm going to say Spanish now. Say Spanish, Even though yeah. some people might disagree, <laughs> I, I, I okay, can say okay, I speak okay. Spanish now. Fluent or? I can have conversations, you get do you, me? Do you get lessons here? Like, do yeah, 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 lessons yeah. like every week. A few oh, hours a year, so. That's wicked, man, that's wicked, man. See, that's, that's like, it's a brain box, man. As a footballer, you know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of, like people don't see footballers as, I'm not saying they don't see them as smart guys or anything like that. They don't see them as smart guys, but people are probably look at footballers and think, oh, he's just a footballer. But yeah, yeah. Your real. brain's constantly working as well, you know what I'm saying? You've got your for academics real. to learn as well, but you've got language lessons and that as well, you know what I'm saying? So for real. you're on a constant learning curve, not just on the pitch, but off the pitch as well. Yeah, to yeah. be able to communicate with your teammates, communicate with the locals yeah. and stuff like that as well. So. Yeah, man, we got yourself for that, man, definitely. Yeah. Um, compare your playing style to another player, like who did you look up to? Who was your influence? Mm. Who was you screaming when you was on the playground? Yeah, <laughs> like when I was little, I used to always watch Drogba when he was at Chelsea, you know? Oh, man of culture. Oh. Man of culture. Always, bro. <laughs> always yeah, to man. watch Drogba, yeah, man. Yeah, man. You know, because he's Ivorian, my dad's Ivorian as well. Makes sense. So, yeah. Makes sense, bro. Man said the. You yeah, get me? Yeah. <laughs> it's always in school, right? That one day, bro, you know, listen, John was serious, man. Clutch player as well, in it, of course, Crazy. you get me? Yeah, man, that's and big, yeah. man. And like, I'd probably say right now, I'm watching a lot of, I'd say I'd compare myself to Usman Dembele from Barcelona. Love that, love that, love that. And Mbappe, Rashford, and them three players. You can't go wrong, bro, you can't go wrong. Electric. Electric, electric. Trying to get better, trying to get to that level, obviously, but yeah, I see myself in them sometimes in some plays, so try to just like, try and get better and do what stuff that they do as well. Yeah, man, I respect that answer, man. That's a, that's a, that's a big answer, man. So next section, we've got red card. Um, I'm going to make a statement. And based on the statement, if you agree, you're going to tell me play on. If you're unsure, it's going to be a yellow card. And if you certainly know, like definitely none of that, we're not having that round here. Yeah. It's a straight red card. Yeah, cool. Hopefully you can be a better ref than some of the refs we've had in the Premier League. <laughs> I don't know what they're like around here. I don't, know, I don't know what the reputation of the refs are around here, but in the Premier League at the moment, Lee Mason and them, man. <laughs> yeah, man, it's, it's techie right now. So let's go. First statement, Paris has a better music scene than London. I'm going to say, you know. say, say yellow card, bro. Unsure, really. I'm like, I'm like 50 50 50. Yeah, so techie, techie, bro. bro. You listen to a lot of Paris music. I listen to so much Paris yeah. music. 
like, most of my friends are into, like, some, most of my friends are rappers. This question is like London or Paris, like, is that techie one still? Because you see the two blending now as well, like, obviously, mm. like, Eddie One's going over to France. I'd say drill, though. I'd say drill. I think drill UK started that. UK started that. I think French people, like, Followed from the UK yeah, drill. Yeah, I, yeah. Think, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because UK drill is crazy. It's crazy. It was crazy. Yeah. They started all of that up. Obviously, they adopted it from New York, but then I think when the French got a hold of it, it just, it just went. It yeah, just went yeah, massive. Because, yeah. like I said, the views, then I'm racking up on some of the videos. It's crazy, crazy man. Yeah, yeah, everyone crazy. Is into that. Crazy. So, what we say on yellow card for that one, yeah? I, I'd say yellow card. 50, all right, 50, 50, all right then. Um, Italians have a better dress sense than the French. Red card, man. Red card. Man, red card. Red card. No, man, said no, red card. Red card. Nah. Red card for that. Nah. Obviously, Italians, they're known for that, you know, fashion sense, yeah, stuff yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, but yeah. French people, no, we get, you got that drip. Fashion, you know? fashion week. Yeah. Former fashion week and that. Yeah. You got that drip. Paris fashion week. You've been to one? You've been to a fashion week? I haven't been to one. I haven't been to one yet. I haven't been to, yet. Yet. Haven't been to one. On the bucket list. It's all, I've always been busy when it was been busy. I hear, I hear, I hear. So yeah. I'm trying to, I'm trying to. But... What do you mind think? What do you mind think? French or Italian for fashion? French, it's tech in it because the Italians got the big names. But... French are the romantic, you know, they're known for, you know, they've got, they got to have their. Mm-mm. Good clothes and stuff. They dress good though, don't they? Yeah, they do. They dress really good. I like, I like French. I like the way other French dress. They dress good, man. The, the fashion sense over there is crazy, man. You get me? When you go over there, like you see some of them, you see it on the TV and stuff like that. Like they're just dressed sick. Mm-mm. They're just dressed sick. Um, so what we saying? Yellow card, yeah? Or red, red, red. Trying to catch him off guard. Okay, red, red card, straight, yeah? <laughs> Footballers read about themselves online. I don't. You don't? I don't. And I don't think you should, to be honest. Have you trained yourself not to do that, though? Because it's a case of, like, be honest, like, would you say when you was younger, you did? Because I, I, I admit, like, I'm a music man. If mm. I put out a music video, you get me, like, I look at the comments. Mm. I take, but I'm a person who can take the bad with the good. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. I'm sending the bad comments into my group chat with the man. They're saying, yo, these men, these men are hunting me. <laughs> I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm making light of it, you get me? Whereas some people that haven't got that mentality, you know, eat them up. Yeah, So I can imagine yeah. it's the same with football because. At the moment now, I probably don't look as much, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes I will have a laugh at that, but with footballers, I can imagine like you've had a bad game, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot more tweets. It's great. Yeah, yeah, the, the tweet like, football's the most, one. I'd say it's the most scrutinised sport in the yeah, world. Maybe. So it's like, probably, yeah. even youngsters, they might yeah. get worse than someone that plays ice hockey. So you either hero like, or public enemy number one, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, for real. Game you had in it. And it can change so quickly. That's the funniest thing. You scored a hat trick one week. Next You've missed a penny the next yeah, week. Now, yeah, yeah, now yeah. get out of my club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Saka, yeah. Rashford, yeah, Sancho. It's like yeah. Saka, Rashford, yeah. Sancho. Yeah. Yeah. Mbappe, you and Mbappe, yeah. you even missed that pen for the Euros. Yeah. 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 It's crazy. Now, now nobody can get enough of them, you know what I'm yeah, saying? It's, so you know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Yeah, yeah, it's nah, crazy. Bro. So did you sort of train yourself not to look or was it a thing where you just didn't at all? I think I'm, I'm someone, yeah, I don't, I don't really care about what people like. Respect See, that, I don't really look at, and I'm, I'm not someone who looks at myself that much. Like, yeah. Obviously, after games, I analyze my games yeah, yeah. with like professionals to see how I can improve my game, stuff like that. But for what is social media comments, stuff, I never look at it. You know, mm. I just I don't feel like it's really interesting for me, so I never really look at it. So next section, this is called ranked. I'm gonna make three names. I'm gonna name three different things, and you're gonna rank them from worst to best. So first one, English food. French food, Spanish food. English food. Bottom, <laughs> bottom, yeah, by far. He's had enough food. I said, yo, I tried that fish and chips, yeah. <laughs> that it was the same, it was the same <laughs> much. No. But honestly, I ain't into English food, man. Honestly, English food. Yeah. Bro. Does that what, really, what would you say? What, what, English what is English food? Like fish and chips. chips. Like Roast. Uh, gravy. Uh, gravy. Yeah, Jack gravy. potato beans. Man, say this, but yeah, what's man, the national dish of England, bro? Chicken tikka masala, what the hell, bro? What the hell? Like, it makes no sense. It's the national dish, yeah. It's not even their food. It's not their food, so it's like, yeah, man, like yeah, crazy, <laughs> crazy. Food. Like, uh, uh, you know what? If you come to, if you come to my end, yeah, you see, have you ever, have you had fish and chips? Yeah, I've had fish and chips. You've had plain chips in it. You man ain't had batter chips, have you? What's batter chips? What's batter chips? What like chips in my... What's Orange chips. Orange, orange chips. chips. Orange chips, yo. When you come to, oh, you mean like sweet potato? Next time, nah. You know what though? No, it's a good shout. It's a good shout. <laughs> it's a good shout. <laughs> it's a good. I'm educating man now. You get me? <laughs> educating man. You get me? Majors, yeah. Put him on. Orange chips, yeah. Battered chips. So like these ain't your normal chips, you know? These are like these are chips, yeah, with like an orange batter on. It's like. Paprika, it's like, <laughs> it's elite. Nah, yo, listen. It listen, sounds good, it sounds listen. good. I don't know what no, they're doing in the lab. <laughs> when we're next shooting walls, yeah, when we're next shooting walls, I'm gonna get my orange chips, you're gonna know. If you ever pass through, yeah. shout me. <laughs> we'll go majors, you get me. <laughs> Fish, chips, orange, you get me. Curry sauce, yo, bro, nah. You get so me, we can go no. in and say orange chips, please. Nah, you don't say orange chips, you get fish and chips. Oh, okay. You say I battered or plain. 
plain chips are Durban, you get me? Like, plain chips are just plain chips, right. it's dry, but when you come to the ends, yeah, you get orange chips from majors, yeah. Is this just the Wolves thing? It's a black country thing, so Wolves, West Brom. Uh, Maybe Birmingham, but more Wolves, West Brom, Dudley, okay. you get me? Like, the, the rough, the roughneck part of the West Midlands, the roughneck part. <laughs> but yo, those battered chips, battered chips, you London, yo, listen, battered chips. So yeah, you're saying English food, bottom of the barrel. English yeah, bottom, man. Then I'd say Spanish, Spanish. then French. Ooh. French. I love my French food, man. French yeah. food is nice, bro. Yeah, you can't go wrong with French French food. breakfast is elite, though. French breakfast can't is nice. Can't beat French French breakfast, breakfast, isn't it? What? But, it's, bro, you can't have that when you're a football player. Man. Nah, I hear that stuff. Like, obviously, you're going to say it's nice, but like, I, never, I never have that, bro, because yeah. you know how much you can gain from all the... You can't, you can't, you can't, you can't you know how much you can man, gain from man, all can't just that. eat one croissant, you know? You get me? You're going for two <laughs> butter croissants, yeah, three, you get yeah, me? Sweet, yeah, man, you get me? I hear you still. I hear you. Um, English music, French music, Spanish music. Spanish music at the bottom. I don't you listen to Spanish. Yeah, I was gonna say because you're here now. Do you, have you found any Spanish artists? Any even like even, what's the drill scene like over here? Do you know any? Like, nah, they don't, they don't listen to drill here. What's the drill? They listen to um. Like reggaeton. Oh, reggaeton. 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 That's what I was going to say. I forgot. Yeah, yeah. They listen to reggaeton. They yeah, love reggaeton yeah, here, that's, man. That's the main thing. So yeah. what's the, what, what's, what are they like? Obviously, you know, Daddy Yankee and the man, but is that, is that class, mm. does that come under the Spanish wing? Well, that's the thing, they listen to a lot of that, but it's like, that's more Latin. Latin. Mm, like, mm, they mm. have like, for me, like the actual Spanish music would be like, El Canto del Loco, Fito y los Fiti like stuff like that. Context, context, he's Spanish, he's Spanish, context, context. You know what's more than me, man. Like, that's like Spanish music, the other <laughs> stuff is, but you do get like, La Rosalia is Spanish, and she does reggaeton. Yeah, which is, I like her, she's, she's nice. She's, she's nice, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I yeah, like her, she's good. She's, I, I, we listen to her a lot in her. Yeah, in changing she's room. Yeah, she's well. nice, she's nice. You can do a little, like, little, you can, like, yeah, you can do yeah. some, a few steps. This guy soon is missing the Spanish music, you know. <laughs> you can tell you get my man got there. I like it, man, I like it. So what are you saying, yeah? English, what are you saying? Spanish last. Spanish last. Spanish, Spanish music last. That much. What are yeah. you saying out of the French and English? Because we had this talk earlier. I know. I'm gonna I'm put, I'm put English and then French because I listen to, I listen to a lot more French music. Yeah, man. So French first. You saying? I'm gonna put French first, man. All right, then. All right, then. So, Kings League, Premier League, or La Liga? You watch much of Kings League yet? I haven't, you know. You haven't watched into it. I haven't watched much of it I'm myself. I'm not gonna it, lie. Man. I've heard about it. I've heard the hype. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm gonna look hype. into it, but yeah, it's man. good. It's entertaining. It's entertaining. definitely different. That's for sure. I can imagine. Yeah, now for real. So like, what worst to best? Yeah, worst to best. I'm, put, I'm gonna put Kings League. Yeah, I don't know, but I don't know the don't too know much about it. Like yeah, 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 yeah. And then Premier League and La Liga. Ah, I'm not sure, you know, because it's different. It's very different, isn't it? Yeah. It's so different. Like it's different, man. La Liga is so like technical. It's just pure football, you know. And like Premier League is like in so much intensity in the football. Like, mm. like you're watching it on TV, you're like, yo, yeah, bro, yeah, what's yeah, going on? Space, yeah. You get me? Like some yeah. game is crazy. And league are not as much, but it's like different types of plays, technical stuff like that. So it's different. I can't even like put them worse. Than... Are you guys familiar with the term farmers league? Farmers league, of course. Bro. It's mad that it like, but like I don't get why that gets thrown about. Like me personally, like I don't get why it gets thrown about because like, mm. Cause like league, yeah, because Premier League for me, for loads of people, is like the best league in the world. Yeah, know? yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. that's why like English people would love to say farmers league. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, in yeah. other countries, but. But, I don't really agree with that. But then who's winning? But then who's winning Champions League all the time? You know what I'm saying? It's mad. It's mad, isn't it? But they're throwing it around, different. and like they say, like Bundesliga or Serie A, Farmers League. Yeah. They've never watched the game, so it's like, how yeah. can you say that without watching? I think the it's game? just a pride thing, isn't it? You do yeah. get armchair experts, though. Yeah. Armchair right. experts. There is people that will be like, you could tell someone you did something. I'm like, oh, I did that last week. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Farmers yeah. League. It's like, oh yeah, I could have done that. Yeah. You know, you couldn't. But yeah. like, yeah, it's just something to say. It's mad, isn't it? So, ooh. Boys' night out, date night, or a night in? The worst. Worst. Worst to best. I'd say date night. <laughs> oh is, that, is that because you're paying, yeah? Because <laughs> <laughs> you're paying, yeah? It's on you, yeah? Is it on you? Or you're really? money, if if I you trying to get a girl to pay? Nah, honestly, honestly, I ain't even like that. If I, it depends on my mood, you know. I hear you. But nah, mostly I pay. I can't even lie. I, I respect it. I respect yeah, it. I respect you it. You have to be a gentleman. You never, you never, you never, you never tried the Joey Essex and stuck it on the gal and said, "Yo, what's your pocket like?" <laughs> <laughs> you get me? Like, reverse the psychology. You get me? Like, imagine you're out at a restaurant. You get me? The bill comes. Have you got this? I always do that, you know. Have you got this? Bro, when the bill man. comes, when the bill comes, as a joke, yeah. as a joke, as a joke, joke, I would be like, see how long you can run it for, like, just yeah, to like, see the color go out of yeah, their face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, but it's good to see like what they're about. Like, like test say, them like, a bit. You get like, me? Yeah, cool. If they're not, they're like, oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah you, know you get, get for? I respect that, man. So what you saying? I don't even go on dates like that. I don't go on dates. I don't do dates. I don't do dates like that. Saving himself here. You get me? Saving himself. Yeah, man. We'll slide. We'll slide. We'll slide from this one. We'll slide. Next, next question. Next question. All right, then. So that's a wrap. This is Next Gen 
on tour, group chat. We've got James, Jules, and Mo. It's been a pleasure having you, bro. You get me sick guy, keep doing what you're doing. Thanks, man. You're at the Thanks, forefront man. of the store. Hopefully you're at the forefront of the football <laughs> game soon. You get me. Big up yourself, definitely. Thank man. you, man. Respect Thank for you. giving us your time, man. Yeah. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Thank no you problem, for having bro. me, bro. For real. Yeah, man, yeah, man. We're out. Group chat. Mm-hmm.